That tub of goo is asleep right in the way to Yorna Desert. Take a little Marin and wake him up with her singing. I see, so I have to bring a uh, Marin. Wonder if it's gonna be like I gotta actually escort her or what? I don't I don't know. Oh, where the hell is Where's Marin? What happened to her? Yeah, true. What? Yeah. Oh, down here maybe. Yeah. Yep, there she is. The walrus wants me to go to him? Well, all right, let's go. Here we go. What the hell? <laughs> Is this your big chance, bro? <laughs> okay. <laughs> this game is goofy, man. I, I like this game. I like this game. Wait, will she? Can she jump over this? Okay. <laughs> Don't even need a running start. She just does it. All right. All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And if you're not, I pray your day gets better. Last video, part, episode, whatever you want to call it, of A Link Between Worlds. We, um, well, honestly, we didn't get much done. We kind of wandered around for like 30 minutes, uh, stumbled upon the color dungeon. I kind of completely forgot this existed. Um, got ourselves the blue mail. So now we take half damage. And then uh, I figured out how to get over here to the animal village. Turns out I completely missed this bush here was hiding a staircase. Well, I stumbled across it, like past it like five different times, but you know, it is what it is. Um, but yeah, now we're gonna try to figure out how to get over to the uh, desert in the bottom right. And already I have to cough, one second. Uh, nothing like coughing whenever your uh, throat feels like gobbed up or whatever. All right, can I even talk to these guys? They're animals, right? I see, you can. On such a nice day, we need a song from Marin. Well, you were lucky. I do have a song from Marin, if this is what you mean. I didn't mean to press it twice, I just wanted to see what he said. <clears throat> mm. Well, surely I have to, um, play that song somewhere or maybe I gotta bring Marin over here right maybe can't go to Maid Village because of all the monsters I hope Marin is all right and they they care for Marin quite a bit huh she must be a regular over here did you know Animal Village and Maid Village are sister cities yes even though they aren't large large enough to be called cities anyway I heard from a very good source that they have a dream shrine in Maid and that it has something good inside yep I've been in there this is factual information, my lad. <clears throat> Alright, well, I guess we should start by exploring the inside of these animals' houses here. Maybe we can trade off that honeycomb. Yarn of the desert. There's a way to get there to the south, but you might not be able to get through if that lazy walrus is in the way. Yeah, I noticed that. I do remember we had to play a song to wake him up. I don't remember what it is, though. Yeah, yeah, I already talked to you. <clears throat> Alright, what is in... This is a qu quite the colorful house here. I am Shul Donovich. The mermaid statue by Zibe is my masterpiece. To tell you the truth, that work is not complete. The art, it's uh, difficult for you to grasp, is it not? Uh huh. What about you? I see. Interesting. Interesting assortment of uh, individuals gathered in this village for sure. <clears throat> All right, you don't know the proper etiquette when dealing with a lady, do you? You should have brought flowers or something. Then I might be more inclined to talk with you. Hibiscus. Okay, so we probably trade off the honeycomb for hibiscus then. I need to figure out where to do that. I do remember, um, you know, I'm not going to spoil it. Although you could probably piece together where it goes. What the hell was that noise? What wasn't that guy, was it? Uh, no, I didn't do nothing. Hmm. I definitely heard something in that water. I mean, maybe we can't do anything in here yet. All right. You know what? Let me just go back and go back. Or, uh, yeah, let me go back in and just see maybe if there's something I missed. <laughs> what a noise. Maybe I throw it in the water? No. Not quite. All right. Well. <clears throat> I'm just gonna say there's nothing to do there. Okay. Last house here and then we'll probably be on our way. Hello. Oh, I bet you want the honeycomb. 
Hey you, is that possibly a honeycomb you have? I just ran out, will you swap it for a pineapple? Sure. Hmm. A pineapple, huh? Yeah, I know, that tub of goo is a sleeper out in the way till you're in the desert. Once he's asleep, he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take a little Marin and wake him up with her singing. That slob would wake up with a jump if he heard her sing for sure. I see, so I have to bring uh, Marin. Mmm. Alright. Wonder if it's gonna be like, I gotta actually escort her or what? I don't, I don't know. Okay, so. I think first thing I want to do before we do that, I want to go and explore this cave up here. Yeah, because I didn't get I didn't get the chance to do that in the previous part. We uh, ran just right out of time there. Oh yeah, speak speaking of um, not being able to do stuff. Uh, so yesterday I didn't upload a video. It was supposed to be this video. You might be wondering why. Um, pretty simple answer. I just quite simply wasn't feeling it. You know, sometimes that happens. You know, I'm just trying to avoid burnout, really. And, um, you know, I don't want to force myself to make videos if I'm not, like, feeling it. You know, <clears throat> I just really wasn't in the mood for whatever reason. I was, like, really tired, just no energy. So, you know, I just didn't make a video. That's kind of all it was. So. Uh, ooh, can I... I need the hook shot for that too, don't I? Well, something tells me the next item we're going to be getting is the hook shot, based on all the uh, hook shot related things I'm seeing here. Because I don't think we can make that jump, right? I mean, I'll try it once. Oh, that's close, but yeah, no. I think that's probably like a if if you can make that jump, it's probably like pixel perfect or something, right? But all right, I'll tell you what I did do yesterday though, while. Uh, I, I was just kind of sitting in bed all day. No lie. <laughs> um, but I was watching um, The Haunting of Hill House. And let me tell you, that show, so it's it's a Netflix exclusive, whatever, right? <clears throat> Excuse me, I got the hiccup slightly where I'm drinking coffee. I don't know why, but coffee gives me the hiccups. Um, so it, it's... It's not really a horror show in the sense of like, you know, it's like super scary. I guess you could say it's psychological horror. It's more like psychological horror. Um, but damn, that is a really good show, man. I ended up binge watching the entire thing over the course of like the last two or three days, right? Um, honestly, like I went into it expecting it to just be like kind of cheesy. You know, I was recommended to it by my dad who said he watched it, right? Um, I went to it thinking it was going to be like some sort of like cheesy kind of, uh, what the hell is this? Oh, oh, that's for the, uh, yeah, that's for the make a dungeon thing. Um, cheesy jump scare fest, you know, no real substance to it, but oh man, was I wrong? So that show is, um, oh, where the hell is, where's Marin? What happened to her? Yeah, true. What? Um, it's actually got a pretty good plot. So, okay, obviously it's about Hill House. I'm not going to go real deep into the specifics or nothing. In case any of you guys end up being interested in watching the show yourselves. But, um, I would highly recommend it. Work too hard now my broom is worn to the handle. Let's see, so I need to trade for a broom. Um, it's about Hill House. It's, so, it's like this family, like, I want to say six. Let me think. Probably like seven. I, I, I don't know. Um, and they basically, they, they're house flippers, right? And they move into this giant mansion, obviously called Hill House. And they're going to, they move in for the summer. They're just going to work on it, flip it, yada, yada, yada. Um, and the whole show cuts in between, um, it cuts in between the present and the past. And the past is like them living in Hill House. And the present is like, because the past is like 92 and the present is like 2018 or something, right? So, and they're like all traumatized. They're trying to deal with it like all different ways, right? Um, and it kind of cuts in between uh, past and present, you know, whatever. The hell? 
Okay, well, that's a new doll. Yeah, 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 I'll play. Um, oh god, which one? Okay, move right. Ooh, that sucks. But, it cuts in between past and present, trying to explain, you know, the, the more, the longer the show goes on, the more you understand, like, why they're so traumatized, right? It starts with, like, just, they're hearing noises and stuff. And then, as most haunted houses, you know, shows, whatever goes, um, the, the paranormal experiences get, like, way more, um, extreme the longer they're in the house, right? Um, and it ends up, like, just driving them all insane, yada, 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 right? Well, um, it's actually a pretty interesting show, because, like, it all leads up to present day, right? Because, uh, the present timeline, this is all, like, happening in a day or two, maybe, right? Something like that. Um, meanwhile, the past, like, flashbacks and stuff is taking place over the course of, like, two, three months. But, yeah, they're trying to flip this house, and just more and more strange shit happens, and the house ends up breaking down more and more, and at night, they're, like, being possessed by the previous... Not possessed, but, like, they're being haunted by the previous, um... Like, just so, some entities, right? At the just like really mangled looking beings in the house um but it, it is worth a watch it isn't like i said it isn't like jump scary or nothing you know even if you aren't into like horror stuff i'm not into horror stuff i'm gonna I'm a be real I, <laughs> i'm a bitch i won't lie uh i will not watch horror anything because i'm just i get jumpy like way too easy so i avoid it altogether. but um yeah, it, I, I, I watched it regardless, and it, it, it doesn't really... It, there, sure, there's like a few moments where it jump scares you, but it's mostly, like I said, just like psychological. Or, my husband is lost in the mountains. He must be starving. Yeah, he'll be aight. Oh. Ooh. Okay. But yeah, I finished watching that, and then I started watching Bly Manor, and I've only gotten to watch like two episodes of that so far. It's a similar, similar premise, except, you know, it's not like past, present, nothing, right? It's, um, strictly, well, I guess it is kind of like past, present, but it's more like, um, one of the tenants is recounting, um, man, where the hell is Marin at, man? I guess I should go back to May Village and figure that out. But uh, one of the tenants or something, someone is recounting like all the stuff that happened at uh, Bly Manor, right? In story fashion. Um. So, but basically, it's about these. This woman, she's American. She uh, ends up living in England. She finds a job listing for like all pair or something i forget what it's actually called but basically she's taking care of this uh rich guy's like two kids because he's extremely busy yada 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 can't do it himself yada 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 um and then she moves in starts taking care of him and then she realizes like there's a bunch of weird shit happening and the kids are kind of uh peculiar to say the the least you know like they're they're kind of strange okay i know i don't have any idea of where Baron could be, by the way. So I'm gonna just go back to Animal Village, probably something over there. But yeah, it's pretty interesting, man. Cause like, okay, and and not the kids are like telling telling her, no, don't go out at night. And th there's just like some weird shit happening with these dolls that uh, th this girl Flora owns. It's just really really weird stuff. And that kids are acting like super weird. And the boy got kicked out of boarding school for killing. Uh, um the priest's uh bird or something it's it's super odd super super odd but yeah um i don't know quite yet if it's better than hill house because i'm only on like episode two or whatever right but it does seem like it's going to be a promising show so i'm excited for that also these guys are absolute nuisance no nah, piss off Alright, so there's that mermaid statue my boy was talking about. Okay, what's this? What do you say? Tickets are like water when it comes to bridges. Aha. Uh -huh. mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. Box. 
Alright. So. Do, am I supposed to take this? I remember there's something to do with this. Or maybe I throw it. Oh. Well, that's not. That's definitely not what you're supposed to do with that. Maybe if I go up here, he'll respawn. Because, like, grass and stuff respawns, right? So maybe the box will? Yeah. Can I just, like, push it? Okay. Well. Can I just, like, set it down, maybe? Hmm. Maybe, maybe. Right. Is, is there just a sit down option? Nope. My boy wants to chuck it. Okay. Uh, perhaps I'm supposed to have the boomerang for that as well. Or not the boomerang, the hook shot, because there's another box on the other side of there. I can't even jump on top of this, really? Hmm. <laughs> Let me just try throwing it in the water again. Yeah, it just breaks. Is there anywhere I can, like, take that box, maybe? Like, up here? Okay, well, let's just talk to uh, our boy here. Maybe he'll clue us in. In the Yona Desert. Okay, well. Useless. <laughs> ah! Chill. Useless hint. <laughs> Where the hell could Marin be? Also, what is in this? Okay, is there anywhere else to go, really? No? Not quite. I'm trying to think. You know, the only place over here we didn't check was, like, the fishing... The fisherman's house and the dream shrine, right? Hmm. Unless we gotta go up here now. I doubt we have to go up here, right? Let me see. Yeah, no, I don't think so. You know what? Let me just try playing this song here for the uh the old walrus see if that does anything right probably not but where the hell could marin be mm. maybe i wasn't close enough no ah hmm <laughs> Peculiar, I must say. Doesn't give you much to work off of either regarding like where she could be. It just kind of tells you like, oh, she's not with you? No, no, she definitely ain't. Hmm. Oh, I really don't want this, this part to be just another like 30 minutes of me wandering around trying to figure out where the hell to go, man. That would be pretty, pretty lame. <clears throat> All right, I guess I'll check inside the dream shrine. Maybe. Maybe she's in there. I don't know. No. Hmm. <laughs> Where could she be at? Um. I didn't talk to this person, did I? No, I don't think I did. Maybe she knows. Nope. Fine fur coat. I don't think they have fur. <laughs> Maybe they do. Maybe they have like a uh, peach fuzz. What the hell? Where could she be at? This house? Could be, right? I'm thinking that's like the only place she could be at, right? I think so. All right, we're just going to go down there and check in. If she isn't down there, I'm probably just going to Google it because I really don't feel like wasting any time just wandering around looking for nothing, right? Also, do I, can I give you the pineapple, maybe? No. Yep. All right. Oh, down here, maybe. Yeah. 
Yep, there she is. I'm glad you found this place. Will you stay and talk to me for a while? Sure. Sure, sure. It's a nice view. Wow, what's happening? What are, what are we talking about here? I wonder where these coconut trees come from. Terrence says there's nothing beyond the sea. Well, that's cat. I believe there must be something over there. So they really think they're like the only people in the world then, I guess, huh? When I discovered you, my, Jim, my heart skipped a beat. I thought, this person is coming to give us a message. Yeah, the message is you are not alone. If I was a seagull, I would fly as far as I could. I would fly to faraway places and sing for many people. If I wish to the wind fish, I wonder if my dream will come true. Dude, I, being a bird would be lit, bro. I would love to be able to like fly. That's like one of the things. You ever have those dreams where like you're flying and shit? That, that's just incredible. Are you listening? Yes. I want to know everything about you. The walrus wants me to go to him? Well, all right, let's go. Here we go. What the hell? <laughs> Is this your big chance, bro? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, cool. The music changed. <laughs> This, this game is goofy, man. I, I like this game. I like this game. Well, I wonder if she has uh, any sort of reaction to being in here. Probably not, right? What do you think? Mm, can't even talk to her. Ah. Ah, that bothers me so much, man. I want to know what's up with that. I wonder if we step inside of that. Wait, will she? Can she jump over this? Okay. <laughs> Don't even need a running start. She just does it all right um i wonder if she'll follow us if we take this hopefully right okay she does good, good, good. oh man what a game went from picking her up and you like an item to just like uh to her making like jumps like that with nothing just casually just no momentum just does it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Shall we give him a little surprise? Yeah, wakey, wakey. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> What in the bro, look at his face! <laughs> bro was flabbergasted. <laughs> Certainly woke up a start, true. Oh, he's calling me. It's, it's the same as always. I'm going to the animal village. Please drop by. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything over there that we can do now that Marin's there. I kind of want to go check before we jump into this uh, next dungeon here. Right? Yeah, let's do it. What you got to say? Seems to be totally absorbed in her song. Yeah. Hmm. Whoa. What? Oh, you know what? You know what this is? This is uh one of the rabbits used to be here, and where it's not here now, its collision is still there. That's weird. That's weird. I bet it's gone now though. After we leave, guarantee it's gone now. Yep. Sure enough, that's what it was. Oh, that's so weird. All right. Maybe this guy wants to talk to us now. Maybe. Hello. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Okay. Well, let's just go. I'm gonna go ahead and hop on, on uh, over to the desert and check everything out there, I suppose. I want to figure out what the, what this pineapple, who we get the pineapple to. I reckon I'll figure it out eventually. Oh, nice. Pokies. Dope. All right. Um, I want to go to the right here first. Oh, Lord. Okay, so there's nothing there. 
Alright. You know, this section looks a lot bigger on the map, but it's really not that large at all, is it? I, I, I already said this in, like, the previous, uh, video. Saying that same thing, how, like, the map looks, um, big, but it's actually quite small, but it's, like, dense, right? So. Hmm. Hmm, this doesn't look too friendly. You're only getting in the way. Huh? Oh. Oh, I, I, I thought that was still a cutscene. I didn't know I was actually playing the game. Okay. Uh. Ah, shit. Okay. Hmm. Ah! Do I even have a... I don't have a fairy still. I sure probably wouldn't got it. Ah, it'll be alright. Please. Oh, no way. Damn. You got a lot of health. Might have helped if we, uh, got that red mail, but, you know. I'd rather not die as much, you know. Slow and steady rather than, uh, blasting through it. There we go. Oh, well, there's the key. Yep, well, that wasn't too bad. Sure. Might as well go over here and look at the rest of the desert. Why not? Sea bears foam, sleep bears dreams, both in the same way. Crash. That's ominous. Uh, do I want to go down the stairs already? Hmm. I reckon we will. Doesn't seem like there's anything really down here anyway, right? Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Oh, I guess. I need to go get that uh one from the crane shop. There was also one in the uh just the normal shop too, right? Yeah. Also, yeah. We're we're getting close to being able to buy the uh the bow. Alright. Please. There we go. All right. Put this on and we're good to go. All right. Oh, harpies. Hey, there we go. And don't need no damn fairies. We get our, we get our uh, health right here. Perfect. Oh, that was a whole new heart container too. Hell yeah. That couldn't have gone better. All right, well, so the angler key, I guess I reckon that opens up this. I mean, I'd, I'd be shocked if it opened up anything else, right? Uh, oh, no, it opens up that, I bet. Hmm, I don't know. I reckon I won't know until I go and check it all out here. Okay. Oh, weird. We, like, jumped in the air. Oh, God, our Alfred. Oh. The shape of the key shows a fish swimming up a cascade of water. Go now to the mountain waterfall. Oh. Leave from the top and you'll reach your goal. I see. So, it is the one at the top of the map. Then what, what, what is this, then? Another optional dungeon, maybe? Hmm. Don't know. Yeah. I reckon we still got to go that way, though. Something. Hmm. Maybe not. How the hell am I going to get up there, though? Oh, cool. Like, the section map we got to go to is actually, like, kind of highlighted. Subtle, but I like that. So, I need to get up here. What's the best way to do that? Yeah, how the hell do we get up here? Looks like the best way is just through here. Uh, I'm not crazy, right? Yeah. I feel like we have to go through here. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> 
could be. Yeah, all that, all that over there on the right looks like, uh, no, because that's a whole different dungeon, ain't it? Looks like it. Oh, man. Oh, what the hell? I accidentally magic powdered that other thing, too. Yeah, here we go. Didn't even realize we'd go this way. What? We just spoke to you like two seconds ago. There are two shrines, one to the north, the other to the south. First, head south where ancient ruins speak of the windfish. We'll learn much there. First, head south. I don't think I will. Besides, where the hell is this ancient shrine you speak of? I get. I guess it's talking about this. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. We're just going to go. Yeah. All right. Um. Yeah, this is definitely the way. Please. I wonder if they uh, plan on remastering any more Zelda games here uh, soon. The windfish slumbers long, the hero's life gone. Uh-huh. Oh, shit. I would not mind seeing, um, seeing like a remaster of the uh, Oracle Zelda games. Because, I've, like I said before, I've never played those games, so I wouldn't mind it at all playing those for the first time. Oh no, I feel like at this point, uh, it's just way too beyond my time to enjoy those games uh, on the on the Game Boy, right? So, if I was going to play it, it'd probably be a remaster. Oh, here we go. Perfect. I had to go, go get some more bottles, right? Surely we get more than one bottle, right? Got to. <laughs> Problem. Ah. Well, I guess we gotta go south then. Hmm. <laughs> Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh, you bastard. Oh, I hate these guys so much. Ah, oh, piss off. Okay. I don't think we're supposed to be down here yet, but I'm going to go down here. Yeah, I think we're, uh, maybe, maybe we are supposed to go here. Maybe we get the hook shot here. Oh, I kind of need the bow to take care of these guys and shoot them in their eye. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's straightforward as you just hit them in this game like it is in like Minish Cap and stuff. Oh lord. Okay, nope. Yep, we're almost at our destination though. Oh my lord, dude, the, the chooms, the slimes, whatever they're called in this game. Holy shit. Annoying bastards. I feel like maybe magic powder works on these guys? No. Nah. I guess I'm just supposed to hit them to move them out of the way, I guess. I, I don't know. Wake up. Wakey, wakey. Yeah, I, I reckon that's what I'm supposed to do. Alright. There we go. Not too bad. What is this? Uh, that's not a good sign. Probably do need the bow. Uh oh. Yeah, I bet we do need the bow. Hmm, yeah, for sure. Uh, is there any way to just like leave? Am I trapped? Oh, no. Oh, here we go. Oh, that. Good. Good. <laughs> I thought I, I fucking, uh, I thought I soft locked myself. Ah. Bro, damn. Chill. Oh, shit. Okay. 
guess now I gotta hit you in your face or something. No. Bro, I'm jumping, please. Bruh. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Maybe now I need the bow? Yeah, I don't know. There we go, I guess. I'm not quite sure what I did, but sure. The face key, huh? Okay. Here we go. Good thing I got at least like two magic powder. To the finder, the Isle of Koholint is but an illusion. Human monster sees sky, a scene on the lid of a sleeper's eye. Awake the dreamer and Koholint will vanish much like a bubble on a needle. Cast away, you should know the truth. Hmm. Interesting. I guess this is what the, uh, the owl was talking about. Yeah, that definitely would have been a lot easier if I had the bow, I imagine. <laughs> but, oh well. I see you've read the relief. Well, it does say the island is but a dream of the windfish. No one is really sure. Just as you cannot know if a chest holds treasure until you open it, so you cannot tell if this is a dream until you awaken. The only one who knows for sure is the windfish. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Where the hell did I use this face key at? Probably, like, here? Hmm. This must be the other. Yeah, okay. That that's the face key. Uh, why couldn't we go up here again? Oh right, that was a fairy fountain. That was nothing. We can't swim. Yeah, I, I have to come back to that. Alright. Um. Oh, getting out of here is going to be a pain in the ass, huh? Okay. Well. Shouldn't have done that. Uh, yeah, getting out of here seems like it's going to be take a minute. Oh, this guy's just stuck. Ah, oh, oh, the damn chews. Please. Yeah, piss off. Oh, this wasn't even. Oh my lord, this wasn't even the way. I fooled myself. I'm starting to get a little bit heartburn from the uh, drink of that coffee. Probably wasn't a good idea after all to drink that, but I do like my coffee, heartburn or not. That's cool. I I, I hate the slimes, like the, the collision boxes of the slimes in this game. So strange how it works. I'm gonna make a pit stop at this ferry here, and then uh, I don't know. I reckon we'll. I don't know. I don't know where to go, honestly. So there, there's the face key, obviously, but I don't know where I'm supposed to go with that. Without being able to swim. Hmm. I guess. Let me look at the map one more time. I feel like we have to, oh, we have to get up here somehow, right? No. How the hell are we going to get up there? Oh, oh, I know how. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause there was, um, there was a bit we needed the Pegasus boots for if, uh, you remember. And like a previous part, we needed the Pegasus boots to do something in some sort of cave up there. I, I think, right? I might be thinking of a different cave, but 
Yeah, that could be could be what it is. So let's go over there to uh, that top left section of the map here, and then we'll see. Ah, uh, thank you. Yeah. That's probably progress, right? I don't think we can do shit with these boxes down here, so. Alright. Yeah. Man, we really don't have... Uh, surely there's, like, some sort of warp point I'm missing that goes, like, up there to the top left. Besides that one on the mountain, obviously, but surely there is. All right, well, reckon I might as well just head up there. And if it isn't up there, I might just make a cut until I do find it. Hey! I did not mean to hit you. Chill. Oh, crap. Also, wait, 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 wait. Where, where's the entrance of this guy's house? Homeboy, how do you enter your crib? Bro is climbing in and out of his windows every time he wants to leave. Sure. Ah, the Pegasus boots are like kind of awkward to control. It's like kind of slippery, I guess. Kind of strange controls. Or was it one of these uh, tree logs, maybe? <laughs> what was this? I'm not quite sure I ever did anything in here, right? Hmm. Still need the hookshot for that. There, dude, there's so many places you need the hookshot. It's kind of wild. I guess I'll take that, but damn. Once we find the hookshot, life is going to be very swell. Okay. Alright. Let, let's see if this is anything. Could be, couldn't be, who knows. Could have swore there was something. Oh, here was this. Yeah, we never got to open this because we didn't have strength. Ah. I think we can afford the bow now, at least. Yeah, we can afford the bow, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's nothing. That guy's the pin pal, buddy. Oh, what? A, I never spoke to the... Uh, what's his face here? Let, let's see what he has to say. Uh, there's something hidden behind the falls in the Telltale Mountains. Yeah, no shit. You know, that, that might be the least helpful, like, hint system ever. It kind of just, like, is a reminder of what to do more than it is, uh, or, like, a reminder of where to go rather than, um, actually helping. But, I guess. Please. Please. Oh, this area is horrible. Oh, this area is horrible. There goes all my life. Oh. oh. You're kidding. I missed this that long ago. Oh, my God. No way. Oh, I feel so dumb now. Oh, here we go. What does this say? Oh. Bring me any weird stones you find. Sure. This is the wind fish, right? Oh, I should have come up here. This damn owl, man. Oh. The wind fish sleeps long and dreamily in the egg above. When you play the eight instruments of the sirens in front of the egg, he will awaken. Yeah, sure. Also, isn't that one uh, lady's like husband up here? Something? Worried about starving or something? I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, banger. Banger track? Oh my lord. Okay. Yeah, yeah, this is it. Cool. Oh my lord. Look at that. That's gotta be a dungeon. 
I think it is. I think I remember that being a dungeon. Oh my lord, what a dungeon though. Hmm. Ah! Damn! <laughs> um. Did I goof this? I might have goofed that. Wait a minute. I want to get that heart piece. Mostly for the health. Yeah, here we go. Oh, you bastard. Yeah, you died with me. Get screwed. <laughs> Troll ass slimes, bro. Oh my lord. These devs were evil with the slime placement in this game. Oh? Hmm. I bet we can get that now. Can we? Hmm. Maybe we can. I, th I, I reckon it's got to be like... Nice, thank you. Maybe not. Huh. Yeah, it's probably like in a different cave then. I don't know. It's a little weird. Unless I could just like... Nope. Yeah, I don't know. Huh. Yeah, I got no idea. Okay, here's what I was talking about. Yes. Wait. Have we not been in this cave before? Wait, wait, wait. wait. Where, where does this go? I swear we've been in that cave before. Maybe you like the one that has kind of like a similar layout with the uh, little uh, jelly things. What the hell are these supposed to be, by the way? I wonder. Like, what, what's the concept, like the official concept art for him? I mean, you know, I'm curious. I'm going to pull that up. Man, that's super weird. I tried looking like all over. There's that person's husband, I guess. Um, I tried looking all over to see like what it was. That, like there, I couldn't find nothing on it. Just people like kind of speculating what it is. And people was kind of agreeing, you know, it's a carnival tent. But like, huh. I couldn't find no concept art, which I only looked for like maybe five ten minutes right but um that's just weird you'd think i would have found th there might be like more speculation on it or something someone would have found something in some concept art maybe a guide or something i don't know the only thing you find when you google like the weird object because that's what the game refers to it as um yeah popple got lost just like you said now I'm so famished, I can't move. Can you give me some vitals? Bro, this guy, speak peculiar. This pineapple is so delicious. I'm going to eat it right now. Bon appetit. Hell yeah, man. Ah, this wasn't meant to be a reward. Here, take this. It's a hibiscus. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. Awesome. Nice. Yeah, yeah. So who was we get that to now? Damn, boy, is gobbling that shit up. <laughs> uh, it was someone down here in the Animal Village, I think, right? Was it this house? Might have been this house. But, hmm. That is super weird, man. I, you really would think that you would find uh, some more information as to what the weird object is, rather than just, like, people saying, like, Oh, how do I get past this weird object? Oh, my God. You know? But, oh, well. This off. Apparently, those slimes too, they're called Zoles. And then the red ones are called Gels. Kind of weird. I don't know. Zoles and Gels. Okay. Am I supposed to jump from here? No, wait, right? Oh, I can't even get by. You know, if this was uh, a link between worlds link. We could just merge with the wall and get by, but. Hmm. I ain't gonna lie. I actually, like, when I initially went up here, I <laughs> did try to merge with the wall. I won't even lie with you. Uh, I definitely did try to merge with the wall a little bit. <clears throat> okay, so that's not the way. Unless it is. Unless... 
Hmm. Peculiar. Um. So, right over here is nothing. <sighs> let me let me just let me just look here again. Just you know, just just double check. So, is there nothing we can do to get by this? Um, uh, surely a shovel isn't going to help us. Uh, Bada won't. Hmm. I guess we just got to do the trade quest? Maybe? I feel like somehow we got to stop the water, right? But I don't think... Uh, we, we probably... What it is... Right. Oh, yeah, yeah. I missed it. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we need to go all the way back. I'm actually just going to cut. Save you guys the uh, journey back. Okay, so... What I missed was actually like, I, I, I just wasn't looking at the map. We can actually just keep going this way and put the key in from down here. And then that probably, like most likely that this is what deactivates the uh, waterfall, right? Probably. Man, they did not go light on the all the enemies over here though. Okay. Yes. Yes. Turn that bullshit off. There we go. Mm. Do we really just jump off from up there? And it? Yeah, I reckon so, huh? All right, let me go ahead and hit this thing here. Is there anything else? I guess there's that, yeah. We should, we, I'll check that out, I suppose, before uh, I end this, this part here. Unfortunately, didn't get much done. Kind of spent a lot of time wandering again. Oh, okay, well, that's nothing. Well, mm. yeah, I, I would just go in here and then save. That way it doesn't like put us anywhere weird whenever I come back. But... Guys, if you liked the video, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. It really helps the algorithm and in turn brings new people to the channel. And if you really liked the video, I'd greatly appreciate it if you subscribed. I try my best to upload every other day at 9 a.m. ET, so don't miss it. But next video, uh, we're going to go all the way back up here. Before we hop into that next dungeon, I'm probably going to see like what's happening over here, all that stuff. Explore Telltale Mountain. And then we're going to jump right into the next dungeon. So look forward to that. That's all for me today, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video, and peace.